34. Here's meteorologist Tom DeVecchio, your weather authority. It's 511 on this Tuesday morning. Fair skies start out the day and overall not too bad out there. This is our physical therapy and balance centers at weather cam. And uh, looking at Peach and I-90, familiar shot here, dry roads, and uh, weather in uh, good shape as we start out the day. And uh, not all that cold out there for this morning, at least uh, considering it's November 9th. Uh, we do have uh, dry and cool conditions uh, for the kids as they head on to school. Now, we do have some 30s in the inland valleys, but most of you in the 40s and even lower 50s here along the lake shore. Going home in the afternoon, we'll have more clouds around, but no rain. And uh, temperatures, while maybe not as warm as yesterday, not bad. Hitting close to 60 for many of you as you go home. Still not too bad for outdoor recess today. And here we go. Now you can see uh, the influence of the valleys uh, where we have 34 in Cory, but 45 for Becky out there in French Creek. In fact, uh, outside of Cory, everyone well into the 40s and even lower 50s. 52 at Penn State Barron, 50 in Summit, uh, Fairview, south of 90, 42. 48 in McCain, 47 out in Cranesville. East Springfield, Bob has 50. Larry has 48 in the Lake City area. Canadota Lake and Chandler's Valley, warmer than yesterday, above freezing, barely out there in Chandler's Valley, but up to 48 in Westmead, 43 in Linesville, and 41 in Meadville. So a wide range of temperatures for the day. Upper level wave will be approaching, uh, increasing our clouds for today, and probably setting off some nighttime showers here, mainly in the evening. After that, uh, ridge builds back in as we head toward Wednesday, but still a little bit on the cool side, and we'll keep Thursday dry as well. So morning sun, more afternoon clouds, mild temperatures approaching 60. A sprinkle or two may sneak in late in the day. And from your weather authority, uh, some evening showers tonight. Back to partly sunny for tomorrow. Mid, maybe upper 50, so not a whole lot colder. Veterans Day still looking breezy and dry, uh, but showers for Thursday night. Ending Friday morning and rain and some wet snow at times for the upcoming weekend. Good updates to that forecast.